Axel is a little golden retriever with a hint of German Shepherd and a large dose of dragon's blood. <coughs> this story is all about Axel. Not to be egotistical, but that is the name of the story. And Axel, being the main character, has started out with a hard life. He began his tale as a pound puppy with an oddly named cellmate called Dennis Hopper. I thought about asking for his autograph, but he seemed busy at the moment. But enough of that. Let's move on to how things have improved for little Axel. Axel now can look at the window whenever he wants. And he does. So he, he makes rude comments if you ever walked by. He's not racist. He makes comments to everybody. Now, now hold it. Right there. Back to clip up a little bit. Do you see that? That look that Axel's giving? That is a look that you get often from Axel. And it has been dubbed the Don't judge me, bitch. I have dragon blood. While Axel is not talking like an old sea dog, pun is intended, he is planning his next adventure into the great outdoors. And this is Axel's great outdoors. Him running around a tree, pooping and peeing at will. This, if you look closely, is the evil eye, aka Bitch, I have Dragon Ball. <laughs> what did I know at the time what this look meant? And now, Axel goes back inside. The jingling of the keys used earlier is to strike fear into his heart so that he knows who is in charge. Unfortunately for me, Axel didn't care who was in charge. After a good 30 minute chase around the house, good old Axel needs a good rehydration of liquid. After his hydration, Axel often sits in a unique position. Is dubbed the I will have serious hip problems when I get older. If Axel feels that you are not entertaining him to his liking, he will shun you away. But Axel does need to be entertained. He's a little child. He's either sleeping or bounced off the walls. And if you're not providing the entertainment, he will find it himself. And today is in the form of rope. Rope is one of Axel's favorite toys. And he will physically digest it. If that doesn't entertain him, he will force you to play with him. He will force that rope toy into your hand so that he can get a good tug of war out of you. He is very rude and will never, ever ask nicely. But deep down, Axel is a dog. Not like the guy that lives down the street from you, but an actual dog and as such believes any interaction with you needs to be rewarded. He will go through the motions of a so-called trick. But do not be fooled. He is only doing it for the food. Axel also believes 
The eating treats near where you got them is major bad mojo. So he eats his treats in an undisclosed location. And there you have it. The story of Axel. A day with the wild beast who would never hurt a fly. I know I left a piece somewhere.